Hello everybody and welcome to Pandora's Box video tutorials. The brand new server management application replaces the old VNC remote and was completely redesigned visually and technically. The basic idea to provide an interface which allows to remote control Pandora's Box systems in the network remains the same. The big question is, what has been changed exactly and what improvements can you expect? The new application also allows managing multiple systems and keeping track of their status. It provides an overview of nearly all connected devices in the network. But that's not all. Let's have a closer look. We can start the application manually or from here. The new Pandora's Box menu. All new features of the new menu are covered in a separate tutorial. You can find the link in the description. The main screen is divided into the menu bar, the devices workspace and the information panel. The menu bar shows various options. You can organize your projects, work on pages and the VNC view. You can send commands and decide whether your command should be received system-wide, only by the devices on your current page or the currently connected device. And this drop-down gives you the possibility to remote into another machine via the VNC viewer. Simply type in the IP address or select it in the drop-down. Hit enter and the VNC lock-on dialog opens. The default VNC password is Pandora's box. And of course, you need to run the PB menu on the other side as well. There, you can change the password or delete it so that no password dialog appears at all. With the Adaptus drop-down, you can choose which network environment shall be displayed on the active page. The Devices workspace shows per default all active devices with a PB menu running. These devices are automatically added to the active page and shown as online. Once a Pandora's Box version is started, the status changes to Master or Client and Windowed or Full Screen. After the machine is shut down or the PB menu got closed, the device is offline and will disappear on the active page. With a double click on the device, the VNC viewer for this device opens. When doing a right click, various options are offered like Start or Stop Pandora's Box, Reboot, Shutdown or for example add this device to another page. Once you edit a page with a plus icon, the created page can be filled with devices or hardware systems. By doing a right click, you can choose between adding a system or a simple TCP device. A system, for example, offers you also to add the MAC address, so that Wacon LAN works as well through the server management tool. And it offers you the full right click options once it is created. Add an alias to the device and type in the IP address. With a drop-down, you can choose whether it is a Pandora's box system, any kind of custom hardware, a projector or whatever. With a pages bar, you can organize all your devices on different pages for quick access and to monitor the entire system. That gives you the possibility to create different pages for different rooms or to simply separate different kind of devices on different pages. Here, you are completely free to set up your own structure. The last section the information panel shows additional system information in a spreadsheet style for all devices belonging to the displayed page. It shows the IP address, speed of the network connection, the configured resolution or the status and version of Pandora's box or widget designer. You can resize the panel individually. It can be enlarged to cover the entire screen, minimized to a single line or placed at any height on the screen. The selection is reflected on both, the table and icon. And beside that one basic purpose of the server management is to provide you the VNC function, the table in the info panel reduces the need of VNC connections a lot with all the displayed information in it. The server management application is ready for you to be used. You can download the application separately from our download center or you can install the new Pandora's Box menu, which includes the server management. You will find the download link in the description as well. Each point is also explained in detail in our user manual. Have fun and thank you for watching.